Oh, set up painting. I've got a Bob Ross painting that I need to finish. It's my seventh one. Got my nice Bob Ross brushes and liquid white. Um, so I've started this, the sky. I still struggle with clouds. And then also I'm thinking of maybe putting this sketch in oils onto onto this. It's just a bit of canvas paper. Um, so I've moved to there because I was I was painting here, as you can see. <laughs> Let's get that off. Um, but it was a bit high to sort of sit here and do my painting. Um, I don't like working on a on a easel um, so I just thought that might be a bit a bit more easier to work on and I started I did a load of um, acrylic pours if you're interested in becoming a painter or just having a play I just think acrylic pours are just are just a great way of mucking about with paints very satisfying. I've got loads of uh, acrylic pores. Oh, and that was my picture of Wales and the significant places in my life on that. Um, I did a leaf print. I just um, did it on a on a printer. And then this is an acrylic pour and then obviously I painted the rainbow one further. Covid thing, a couple more acrylic pores. This is a different technique, and then I have some. I've got paintings everywhere. I'm taking over the the house. This is my Van Gogh um, type. It's a really nice acrylic pour here. I don't know if you can. The sun shining on it. And then there's a nice, well I've done a bit of an acrylic pour on the ground, obviously written Cariad, which is Sweetheart in Welsh, on that painting, and that paint that needs something more really, and then paintings in here, and then an acrylic pour and then all my painting books and stuff um, this one I did actually on a cruise ship um, they had I can't remember was it Holland and America um, we went to Israel and um, Israel um, with my mum um, and they had a painting sessions on the ship which was really good, I really enjoyed them and that's another one that I did in the painting sessions and another acrylic port and then these two I went I went to an art club, local art club, I only went the once and Covid came along and so I did those two in the art club which I'm quite pleased with That's one of my daughter's art pieces. Chris the Tanton, she's an illustrator. And then obviously I've taken a couple of these to shows and have won. One show pictures. And then this one up here, at the top of the stairs. This one, this was a big, big picture that my daughter had done and it was all just um, black and white. Um, and then I've been playing with it and added some colour to it. So, Carissa. And then, obviously I've got a load of 
Oh, well, I used to do county cross stitch. It's a very tiny one. I don't think my eyesight will let me do the that tiny any anymore. And then again, lots of acrylic pores. Great fun to do. Oh, and then this one looks spectacular. But it is actually painting by numbers. It's really good. And then another painting. Another painting. And then years ago in the RAF, I used to stencil everything. So I'm just on that little stencil. Quite like that. I think I did that with a palette knife. With acrylics. And then another acrylic pour and then I've put um a stencil over it like uh, this stencil here. Oh yeah. I hope you like them. <laughs>